A question that comes up all the time is, what is an earnest money deposit? Clients ask, what happens to that first check I give with my offer or that second check that comes at the time of the purchase and sales signing? And those are your earnest money deposits. They're part of your down payment, first of all. And though the amounts vary, traditionally, you're anywhere between $500 and $5,000 with the initial offer, depending on the circumstances, and then anywhere from you know $1,000 if it's a very low down payment loan up to five to 10% at the time of purchase and sale agreement. This money doesn't just disappear. It's protected by any contingencies you have and it's placed into escrow. In Massachusetts, either the seller's agent or the attorney working for the seller uh, will hold that escrow. And should anything come up during your contingency periods, a release is signed and that's released to everyone. But that's what you can expect with an earnest money deposit. It's those two initial deposits that go down as part of your down payment and secure those two contracts, the offer to purchase and the purchase and sale agreement. I hope this helps explain what exactly an earnest money deposit is here in Massachusetts.